So to explain this mod, we have to start with the history first and foremost. So Mr. T is actually connected to the Deers family because when they were younger, Daddy Deers and Mr. T actually were both performers. We know that Daddy Deers was a rock star and Mr. T did some other type of music in Russia. Now, in the late 1990s, early 2000s, Daddy Dearest had a world tour and he was basically performing in Russia, which is where Mr. T is actually from. While Daddy Dearest was waiting to go on stage to do his set, he actually met Mr. T. And after they talked and kind of chatted for a while, they actually became very close friends. So much so that when Mr. T would go over to America to perform his stuff, he would always meet up with Daddy Dearest. And they became so close that after girlfriend was born, Mr. T became like a godfather slash uncle to her. Meaning that he would actually treat girlfriend as if she was his own daughter or his own family. And this explains why Girlfriend is so excited to introduce Boyfriend to Mr. T or Uncle T as she calls him. And I also want to point out that Uncle T actually greets Boyfriend with open arms, unlike Daddy Darius who still to this day hates Boyfriend. This shows that Uncle T is actually a pretty good person at heart, but let's talk about what happens to him as the mod goes on. So as you all know, this mod starts off pretty fun, pretty light, kind of like the Garcello mod, right? They are friendly, they're getting along, but then Mr. T starts to have some pain in his chest and it's assumed that it's just allergies or something like that, which is why he's coughing. But eventually he falls to his knees and actually starts to puke up this black ichor. And it gets so bad to it seems like he faints and actually dies for a little bit. But even in this state, when he wakes up, he has enough presence of mind to try to warn and protect girlfriend to tell her to get away before he is consumed by this dark ichor that is taking over his face and actually turning him into, or rather making him be controlled by Trollich. And since he no longer has control of his body, he actually attacks boyfriend and girlfriend, but they manage to escape because he ends up slipping on a two liter bottle and the mod ends with girlfriend calling her father to come help, stating that they are somewhere in the Aurora woods. Now, the interesting thing about this ending is that it gives this idea that there's going to be a continuation. And I wonder if we get to see Daddy Dearest be kind of a hero for once instead of being, you know, the evil sucker that we're used to seeing. Let me know what you think about this type of video and if you would like me to go and explain the actual backstories of a lot of the mods themselves. Because I'll be glad to do it if that's something that you guys want to see. And I'm also thinking about live streaming or making videos again, actually playing the mods. Let me know if you guys would like to see me live stream mods on YouTube or uh, maybe make videos and post them. I'd be curious to know what you think. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. This is Orsa Course. Peace, 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 peace.